something new that we're doing here at Existence Athletics. So we talk about nutrition all the time. We kind of nerd out on it, and then we just realize that uh, we forget that everybody knows about healthy fats, right? We just assume that everybody knows everything about nutrition, and then we realize like, oh yeah, there's still people putting margarine on toast and thinking that that's healthy. Well, that shit is not healthy. And the nutrition tip of the week is choose healthy fats. Um, so if you could zoom in just a little bit, what's a healthy fat? A healthy fat is something that's nutrient dense and toxin free. So things like avocados and olive oil and palm oil, grass fed butter, Kerrygold, big fan, lard, olive oil, nuts and seeds, ghee, which is clarified butter. Uh, I did put a little asterisk next to palm oil and that's only because if you go deep down that rabbit hole, you will find that yes, palm oil is uh, very nutritious, all right, and great for you. However, most of palm oil that's around and about happens to also be in an area that's uh, heavily being deforested and it's killing orangutans. So that's a rabbit hole I'm not gonna go down right now. But if you're going for palm oil, just make sure it's sustainably sourced. Don't kill any freaking primates. Um, bad oils. So your hydrogenated oils, also known as your trans fats, your canola oils, your grapeseed oils, your peanut oils, your vegetable oils, margarine, it's all shit. If you have any of this um, in your cabinet, throw it away. Or don't, because um, like we say, we don't really care what you eat, drink, we just want you to know the background of it. We just want you to be informed, and so if you are informed that these things have no place in the human body, then you're good to go. As long as you know that, then I'm comfortable with it. We can all sleep at night. Um, careful with anything that says zero trans fat. If it says zero trans fat, it probably has some hydrogenated oil in it. The way they get away with that is if legally um, there's like less than a half a gram or less than a gram of hydrogenated oil, they can say zero trans fat. But we're Americans and none of us eat one serving, right? Three, four, five. So hydrogenated oil, trans fat. Um, if it says low fat, that's also kind of bullshit because fat's good for you. Um, if you don't have healthy fats, then you won't have healthy cells. So nutrition tip of the week, choose healthy fats, try to source those things as much as possible from wild caught, sustainable, organic, uh, insert buzzword here, animals and plants. Thanks for watching.